somebody, Obama, Condoleezza Rice, Frederick Douglass, I don't know if he's still alive. Please, somebody help us. Please, we're dying out here. We need sustenance. Somebody help us, please. We're dying out here. We need sustenance and we need help. Please help us. <laughs> Dolphins! <laughs> Dolphins! There's so much hate. <laughs> Every day with Link. Every So, what do you think about putting Kool Aid on snow? Okay, I think snow should stay snow. But when you put Kool-Aid with snow, does that make it a snow cone? Like, how would that taste? Oh my gosh, no! Don't tell me you actually tried that. Uh, let's just uh, let's just keep it moving. No, I remember though during that that night, um, it was pretty crazy. I was giving out like cookies and stuff while like in the crossfire with Kool-Aid snow cones. Hey, cookies and Kool-Aid, it's like, you know, a match made in heaven, right? You need to give the people what they want, right? And that's what they want. Okay, anyway, <laughs> next, <laughs> we arrive back to the time when one student got to be president of Southern Kansas University. Just for a day, though. So four students submitted essays and in a writing contest, and they wrote about what they would do if they were president of the SAD. And, of course, only one could win. So, this next clip is actually going to be in two parts. The first part, we're going to see snippets of what the competitors actually wrote in their essays. Then, the next part, we're going to actually highlight the key moments of the winner's day's essay. And stay tuned to find out how 